that is a healthy duo in a good position. Queasy Vino, good position, healthy, but no material. And that is going to be sketchy. But so far, I'm seeing nothing in the feed that would Ooh, indicate cool. that they're going down. We see Clicks and Dukes Can go down see. on spawn. Queasy and Vino. Can we see the mass? They haven't got the refresh. They haven't found it. This is it. This is what happened earlier in the day when they went down. Center Cold took them out. If Queasy Vino get the refresh now, I am fully convinced they'll win this game. But they need the refresh. This is the most important kill of the day for them. Yeah, they fully choked that last time. Ooh. The top three teams are all still in this Ooh. as a duo as well. As Tripper, I say that, I think no. there's a knock on to Tripper and yeah, Tripper goes down. So now it's Thomas left as a solo. Vico the other had two 10 kills when he's sorry. Vico had 10, 10 kills when he took down Tripper and then, yeah. Oh my god. Okay, we're gonna have to jump back in the vods and have a loop. Reed's still in it as a solo though. Reed's still going solo, and is he gonna be able to put the pressure on a queasy and Vino up above? Steady and Kami have dropped down. Chicho takes down Edgy. Thomas takes down Walk. So Thomas still going in this one though. Queasy goes down to Reed. So Queasy does fall from the Reed spray, but Vino's on the high ground. Vino could win this. Kami and Seti, the only healthy duo I think that I can see. Five teams, seven players. Acorn, last time in this situation, game one, clutched up a second. Can he do it as a solo? Thomas goes oh. down. Seti and Kami. Acorn is going to get at least a top three. He goes down. Oh. It's Seti and Kami versus Vino. Vino as a solo. Can he do it? Ten builds for Seti. Kami's got a decent loadout as well. They are healthy. They have good weapons. They have a decent material, enough to work with. Vino has 16 Vino, builds. Though. And Vino, oh, oh my god, Vino's face. Did you see that? Vino.